Hey guys, Alex Rocks dude here, and um, I'm going to show you how to use Command Utility. A lot of people have been asking me how do you use it, how does it work, a lot of stuff, so I might as well show you. So pretty much you do is you just open up Roblox Studio, go into free models, your models, whatever, and it should look like this. That's what it's called. And it has an example of how you install it if you still don't get it after this. Put a link to get it in the description, but yeah, this should help. And this is the important thing: you have to get, you have to make sure you um, copy all this. And you can pretty much just start from the beginning, scroll down, and then hold Shift and click there, and then copy. Close that. You can delete these now and then open up a notepad and then paste it into here then you need to save it as a command utility or you can call it whatever you want, I know I spelled it wrong, but whatever and you want all files and you need to call it dot .lua that way it'll save it as a script that Roblox can run and then we just execute script up here and um, should pop up right there now I can um, use this for any bricks so we're just gonna put in some parts to show okay so here this is what a lot of people like about command utility you can do whatever you want with it even though that is really weird I think that's because they're connected, but whatever. Um, we shouldn't do that. Okay. Now we'll be able to move it through here. All these bricks, you can just move it right through. And it, it's like, you know, putting bricks inside of bricks. It's pretty awesome. And if you've seen it in places, sometimes where you go, they have it like that. And it, it looks like one brick, but it's two, or three, or however many. And I'll see you guys later.